What's up guys, it's Mike for Sim Racing 604 Welcome back to Assetto Corsa and today I'm going to be doing a little follow-up video on a video I did about a week and a half ago featuring a bunch of new free cars by the great Sean Clark. Sean Clark um, is known to many of us for his fantastic Janetta and Seat Leon mods which are posted on Race Department. He recently gave me the privilege of trying out some of his new projects. He let me try no less than six and um, they're now available to the public which is great so I'm gonna drop a link to the description Sean has started a Wix site so you can go there and see all his projects that he's working on as well as download the cars he has finished so very nice of Sean to do that and they're fantastic cars if you've you know tried the Seat Leon or tried the genetic cars he's posted to race department these are of the same quality absolutely fantastic and uh, this Vauxhall you're seeing here I didn't get to try it in the preview video but it's also great and it's available on the Wix site so check the link in the description. In the meantime, to celebrate, I'm going to be taking my favorite car so far, which is the Janetta GT3. I'm going to be taking it around Nordschleife for a lap because what else is a sim tuber supposed to do with a car they really like but take it around Nordschleife? So, time to have some fun. Let's get to it. All right, guys. So here we are, about to start the lap. This is the Janetta. Whoops, a little bit of clutch would help. This is the Janetta GT3. Gonna try for somewhere around six and a half minutes here at Nords. A little bit wide through there, nothing too severe. And we will, coming into Flugplatz here, we will need to lift, certainly, and a little bit of braking. Keep it planted. A little bit of understeer there. Held on to it. As the hot air balloon looks on. 275, 280, 285 kilometers an hour here in this GT3 car. Working with just a slight bit of oversteer through that corner. Down the hill here, again, climbing quickly up 270 kilometers an hour. Probably too early on the brakes there. Again, not trying for any records or anything like that. Just want to see if I can uh, come in somewhere around the six and a half minute mark. Given the uh, high top speed of this car, I think that should be possible. Lots of brakes there. Because you are fighting understeer on the default setup. A little bit of a tap of the brakes there. Fighting, fighting, fighting for that traction. And ugly, ugly, ugly into the left-hander. Give up a fair bit of time there. Love those exterior sounds. You can hear those bouncing off the walls here at Nordschleife. Coming up to the three minute mark here. We will work our way up this hill. Got a lot of power to work with. We should reach just about top speed here, I think. 
despite the altitude change. Such a fantastic car. I mentioned before that uh, in my preview of this pack that the uh, this car actually reminds me the most of any GT3 car I've driven in the Soto Corsa of uh, what ACC feels like through my wheel. So if you're a fan of the uh, force feedback in a set of course of competition, make sure you give this one a try. And into the carousel here. Holding on, bumpy ride. Managed to pull it off. Past four minutes now. With a little bit of tuning, I think I could get rid of that understeer. It's not too, too bad, but it's enough to make you think twice going around some corners. And this is my first actual attempt here. First time bringing it all the way around North Jalifa. So I'm not expecting to be perfectly comfortable with the car but I did want to show it off to you guys because I think it's fantastic huge huge shout out to Sean Clark and his ongoing mod work Going over a jump here just about landed it perfectly flat with all four tires Just about lost it there. The car, car went sideways. Actually caught a little bit of air, or at least got very, very light. Now the left-hander. I have thrown away so many laps in that corner. Certainly won't be six and a half. Again, I need to tune out some of that understeer. I should break seven minutes, though. Let's see what we got for speed here. Will we hit 290 before we hit the rev limiter? 288 up the hill, 289, 290, wow, beast of a car, almost 300 kilometers an hour, will we get in under the 7 mark? Only just, all right. That was fun. Excellent, excellent car. Well done to Sean Clark once again. You guys know I'm a fan of his work, and uh, now he's sharing it with all of you as well. So uh, head on over to the website. Link is in the description. Thank you guys for watching, and we will see you next time.